To create a hyperlink in Photoshop, first we'll need to go ahead and click on the Slice tool. And that's going to hide right underneath the Crop tool. So if we click that and hold down the click, it'll open up these other options. We'll click on Slice tool. Actually, we'll release our click on Slice tool. And now, every time we click and drag, it'll start creating these squares or rectangles. And when you release the click, That'll be one slice, and if we wanted to create another slice tool, maybe we'd click here and drag up. And that has a little magnetic snap to it so that if you get close to the boundary of another slice, it'll automatically click over there. Great, so now we could have two. But if we wanted to create one big hyperlink, then all we need to do is click and drag over the entire image, and it'll create one big slice. From here, we'll just right click on our slice, and go to Edit Slice Options and click on that. Now here's our data. First we'll go ahead and give this a name. We'll call this Click Me. And insert the URL. This is the one piece that you really have to have. And now for Target, you can leave that blank and it'll act just like any other link. Or you can insert underscore blank. And now if someone clicks on it, it'll open up in a whole new tab. And let's go ahead and fill in the alt tag. And that's the text that displays if your image is invisible in non-graphical browsers or while the image is loading. And now let's click OK. And if we're happy with everything, we'll click on File, Save for Web. And now we'll either need to choose a JPEG or a PNG 24 and click Save. And let's go ahead and change the file name to Click Me. And make sure our format is saved under HTML and Images, because it's going to save it as an HTML file and also create your reference image. So we'll navigate to our folder here and click Save. And once it's done, let's go under our folder here. So now we see we've created an HTML file and it's also created another folder to store the images. So if we double click and open up our web page, let's see what we got. All right, now here's our image. And if I click on it, it opens up Google. And that's how you create a hyperlink in Photoshop.